Hey everybody, Phillips Gaming here. I am back again today with another live stream guide thing. Um, I am going to be I'm going to be continuing a secondary part of the stream I finished yesterday, where I was collecting all of the data log entries. Today I'm going to be doing it, but continuing from chapter 13, where most of the letter were three quarters of the letters, since there's only four letters, where three out of four letters are only available there where most of the Omega files are, and where most of the reports are. So this is going to be an interesting predicament, but I will be having to go back and forth between those two areas for a little while. Between the main game area and... I'll be going from chapter 13 directly to chapter 15, unless there's any chapter 14 ne necessities. And I'll also be doing a lot of the uh, monoliths that are inside of the dungeons, because those are... A nightmare. So you'll be seeing me go through hell all the time again. Actually, I'm not sure if I need the monoliths because I do need 100. Well, I need 80% of the data log completed. I have. All of the almanac. I already have most of the monoliths. I'm only missing five of them, so that's not a huge problem. I need to get all the letters. I need to get all the reports and all the Omega files. Skip. The hell? What is it? The Imperial Citadel. Inspect the disturbance. I need to go back to letters for a moment. Okay, it's during the area of the game where it's just me for most of the letters. Oh boy. So is Ignatus Keep is where one of them is. Well, three of them, the reports, where are they located? All only in chapter 13 in the weird... The mass disappearance report and all that stuff. So I'll be, I'll just be doing the letters until I find, until I get to an area that has other things. What now? Only a matter of time before we run out of room to run. Got a better idea? We trade the train for the regalia. Come on! On my way! Knocked! The freight car! Keep moving! Where am I right now? Oh, my ear is not as keep. Threat upgraded. Activating level four security measures. Sealing all gates. Put the pedal to the metal. That's the idea. Don't crash. Thanks for the tip. Where are we now? 
Inside a tunnel. On the train tracks. Don't slow down, or they'll catch us up. Going as fast as I can. Hang on! That's all she's got. It'll do. Are we seriously marching into the capital empty-handed? And with no assurances, the Crystal can beat back the Demon Hordes. Guess we'll find out the hard way. No turning back now, right? <laughs> this thing could come down at any time. Let's be quick. Come on, this way. Hey! Agnes! Bloody...
Below. Might be my ticket to the top. What am I supposed to do? What am I supposed to do? That's the way to the elevator taken care of. Safe to rest here. So 
you're saying anyone can become a hunter, regardless of where they're from or what they can do. Precisely. Right now, we need all the help we can get. But I think a lot of our listeners are worried that help involves putting their own lives in danger. Simply reporting that danger to a senior hunter at HQ is good enough. We all work together as a team to keep the peace. We would never send new recruits on life-threatening missions. We start recruits off on small tasks, such as keeping watch over a neighborhood. I'm sure our listeners will be relieved to hear that. Quiet. Where'd everybody go? This whole city gives me the chills. Too quiet for comfort. How does it feel to be powerless? Can't help your friends if you can't help yourself. <laughs> Gotta hurry and find them. These don't look like typical MTs.
Must be tiring having to run all the time. That magic is a royal disappointment. I'll be right back from the stream in a moment. I need to go get something and say hi to someone who just arrived. Apologies about that stream, I uh, had to take care of some stuff. A good friend of mine came by, so I wanted to say hi to them. And this is the only time in the game series of Final Fantasy that I'll be fighting the rogue Axemen instead of hiding from them. I hate them with a burning passion. Because they're creepy as hell. Oh, forgot there was one there. 
That kind of startled me. Something different about them. Something off. Um. No, I don't want to change route. However, I do want to equip the experience band on Noctis. Stay out of badge. So that I can stay here and make it a rest point. I don't care. Dormitorium Mercenariorum. So the mercenary dorms. running around here It's all coming along swimmingly, isn't it? Crazy cat.
first. Huh. And what have we here? Clearance level. Nice. Security clearance raised to level two. Access to level two zones authorized. <laughs> Poor Prompto must be feeling the heat right about now. Hey, welcome to the stream. What's up? Another trick. Back to square one. Security clearance raised to level three. Access to level three zones authorized. That's one of my personal favorites. Oh, you should have seen the look on your face. You'd best hurry. Next time, it might really be your friend. Are you certain it wasn't the real thing? Wouldn't want to make a mistake. Just so unfair.
your heart's desire. So close now. Soon it will be within your grasp. I suggest you take the central elevator. It will take you to your goal. Aren't you helpful now? One moment, I'm still trying to find this one uh, thing. Oh, okay, I see where to go. I believe you've lost something. Your spine. Oh, now they've found you.
It was successfully repaired the robot by supplementing deficient areas with parts salvaged from our own Magitek armor fleet. I had no luck. I have had no luck in terms of activating the device. It responds ever so slightly when jolted a bit with a with an electric with a bit of electric current. Yet it nevertheless remains offline. <clears throat> I suppose I am left with no choice but to dismantle the device and discover precisely how it operates. Okay, so that's one of three Omega files in the Zegnatus Keep. Okay. Down, don't look down. Gotta find a way to make it move. Heat up.
The higher you climb, the further you fall. Rest easy. Your work is done. Rest easy. Your work is done. crashing on me. Noctis may have the storm's blessing, but his powers remain as feeble as a breeze. Open your eyes, Luna Freya, and see the futility of your f of your foils, of your toils. He is unworthy of your sacrifice and of King Regis's sword. Rely on the Eltish Repl rely upon the Elticians if you must, and cease all contact with the Empire. If you seek a covenant, you know full well the cost. Should Noctis succeed in claiming the power, I shall gladly restore his father's sword to him. So that's all of Revis' letters. The next letter is only available in chapter, uh, from chapter 9 onward, near the Rizarath Basin, so I'm done with the letters for now until later. So now back to the reports, I believe, and the Omega Files. This is during that puzzle sequence, okay. Okay, so this is a little bit later on, so the Omega Files, back to there. So it's still a little bit further ahead. Make for the upper level. So it is during this specific sequence that I'm in. Well, Dad, let's see what your sword can do.
Can't you simply taste the air of foreboding? Did you hear that? There's something out there. I hope my stream is still running. Let me check. I just realized that uh, if it isn't, I'm screwed, so. Okay, so yeah, wow, my stream is updating really quickly, so that's good. by the second. Need to stop it. There's only three Omega files in Chapter 13 exclusively, then the rest is all of the reports and stuff, so. And one of them is in Chapter 14, so it's basically all through this chapter and the next chapter, so I might as well just do both of them either way. Okay, I see where to go. It's such a tease. Go into my items, check, sort.
Security clearance raised to level four. Access to level four zones authorized. without your friends babysitting you. I have grave doubts about your friends. This is the second of the, um, what's it called? Uh, Omega Files. My researchers were met with the most curious of phenomena this morning. The device we dismantled last night was somehow had somehow reformed. We lost four workers when a stray laser caught them off guard. Worst of all, my hopes of the weapon staying online were dashed when it abruptly shut down after its rampage. Needless to say, the remaining researchers were less than eager to continue their work. So it's after I get this. So I, I know where it is.
tragedy could strike at any moment. First keys, now power. What next? What was that noise? Is it scary being on your own Be right back, guys. I need to get food.
Note to self as a streamer. Make sure I have food ready when I start the stream. Hey, much, but it's better than nothing. Oh my god, this guy again? <sighs> Bro, fuck. I love surprises. Nothing.
the Empire made considerable inroads into the science of demons. Well, after I showed them the way, of course. We'd managed to make demons right here. Make? Ever wonder where demons come from? Once upon a time, they were children of nature, beasts and men. Oh, and you've killed so many. Your head can do more than wear a crown. Use it. Vanishing sickness, huh? Including cases around the village, number of missing now stands at 1,657. Early reports from the MRF attribute the disappearance to an infectious disease, and investigations continue as regards to potential connection to the demon outbreak. At the time of writing, the quarantine in West Garley is complete, and other sectors remain infection-free. Vanishing sickness, huh? What's wrong? Don't tell me you're lost. The infantry you... You callously dub MTs all the gathers babes in this very vicinity. Imprinted with serial codes and incubated until they were strong enough to fight. What a pity. Innocent souls fated to suffer at the hands of a foreign king. Well, not so empty after all, are they?
Nine days from the mysterious disappearances in Naria lead, it beggars belief that 812 people in the entire village could simply vanish into thin air. In more tangible developments of the demons that emerged in West Coralia at the same juncture, 60% are confirmed escaped from military facilities. Details of the remaining 40, however, remain inconclusive. Mysterious disappearances. Military applications of mutative plasmodia. In light of the large sample size, te the test results can be considered can be considered conclusive. Commonly occurring parasitic protozoa are the agents of demonification. These findings pave the way for the weaponization of demons, and the first step involves finding a means to control mutated organisms. This report recommends Minister of Research Verstyle. Basithia submit a detailed budget request for the Deathless Project. Interesting name. quarantine report. The infection has since manifested in five adjacent sectors and threatens to reach epidemic proportions. Its spread is invariably accompanied by the appearance of demons, and the likelihood cannot be hood cannot be ignored cannot be hood. Cannot be ignored that the pathogens are demon born. Quarantine has been expanded to encompass all areas in which the creatures are found. Epidemic proportions. That can't be good. The most fascinating tidbit about your dear Prompto what? Turns out he's not empty either. He's got quite the skeleton in his closet. <laughs> Magitech Research Facility Damage Report. Following their outbreak in the north and west, demons have swept through the MRF, causing immense, causing a sense of damage to, the, to equipment. Control was subsequently lost over unprogrammed MTs, and strategies are being d deliberated on the collection of rogue units. Meanwhile, 125 infected patients undergoing testing at the facility have vanished in a manner reminiscent of the first disappearances. Up and disappear. I got pursuit of knowledge finally. Archives, data log, letters, 
seven of them. There are seven of them. Two of them are in chapter 14, the other five are in this chapter still. just missed the turn where the data log is. For some reason I get the feeling that it's in here unless I'm wrong. <laughs> More than half of the keep's inhabitants are now demons. There is no hope of neutralizing them with no control. Not with control lost over the MTs. Outside the city swarms with yet more demons. Form of citizens. There is no escape. Oh, there's another one inside this room too. The infection, the infected aren't disappearing, they're turning into demons. That we failed to see. This. That we failed to see this defies belief. Um, yet dwelling on it avails us not in the face of the demon threat. Though of human origin, they're unlike the specimens. Not really, okay. So. Demons are like a virus, they're a parasite, essentially. Resident Evil is just that people come back from the dead for no reason. Or they're just cursed or something. But in this case, it's more like... It's a virus that turns humans into demons, not into zombies. Really, there's another one? Demon-like, not demon. Security clearance raised to level five. Access to level 5 zones authorized.
There's one way back here that I have to backtrack to to find. So I have to go... I have to turn off B, turn on A. National defense policy. With the mass production of Magitek troopers having commenced in earnest, the Imperial Defense Council approves the implementation of the following reforms. The replacement of human infantry with Magitek units. The, augment the augmenting of, bi of biological materials through cloning. Okay. I believe I only have yeah, four more reports, two more in this chapter, two more in the next chapter. This place. What? what are they keeping inside? Not sure what that is, but I got a hunch it's bad. Don't like it one bit. After I'm done finding these reports, I'm gonna have to end the stream because I have to leave my house relatively soon. Bet there's something here. Which means, it's locked. And if there's a lock, there's a key. Um, that's not meant to happen. Also, Assassin's Creed reference. My 70s posse, they got separated from me. You would have seen that earlier in the stream. But yeah, that's not meant to be floating, and I'm not meant to be able to walk through here, so glitches! Ah, oh, you're leaving? Not soon, but once I'm done getting these reports... Yes, I have to. <laughs> Wasn't expecting that. Things are looking up. How will this story end, I wonder? Intruder alert. Mobilizing dormant Magitek infantry. What the... Wait. Is that what's waiting inside? <sighs> Even more of them. Where are your friends? You don't think oh, they ran off without you? We'll have to beat all these enemies. Sorry, but I have to do stuff. You still haven't found Gladio? Huh? 
a matter of time before Ignis bumbles into a trap. You must feel very much alone right now. I have to go to my dad's for dinner, so I won't be able to stream. Clearance raised to level six. Access to level six zones authorized. Your buddies have bright lives ahead of them. Don't take it personally if they choose their own over yours. without your friends babysitting you. Wellbreaker wave test report. The wave produced exceptional results in real world conditions, effectively inhibiting the Kingsglaive Kingsglaive's warping and spellcasting abilities. Powers that operate on the self seen principle as the wall of Lucis. Lovely. So now, where is the last report? In the same room on the opposite wall. Read. Wallbreaker wave test report. This report concludes that the wave can neutralize not only the wall, but all magical phenomena inhibited exhibited by Lucian royalty. Moreover, based on the data acquired from the encounter with Shiva, an enfeebling effect on the six can also be anticipated. Lovely. In case there was any doubt, it's a trap. Hurry, while you dawdle, people are dying. Switch nearby. Find it. Well, how do you know that? I believe it's the reason we were brought here. Hey! That was close. The hell did you get here? You're welcome. Thanks. After we were separated, we received help. 
from the usual suspect. That bastard's playing with us, but at least we're together. Oh. One of us. Reunited with your retainers at last. How very touching. Must be a fine feeling, having friends. Look how happy you are. I pray you find your dear Prompto soon. This is the last, uh, Omega file. It is with regret that I have hereby suspended my plans to restore Return of the 70s Posse. They're not the 70s Posse! They're greasers, get it right. It is with regret that I hereby suspend my plans to restore this magical weapon to full functionality. The spineless powers that be fear further incidents. And my efforts to activate and control the device were futile, it seems. If it is some sort of autonomous armament, then only divine intervention could bring the mech back online. Until that time comes, however, the device shall remain sealed. Are they actually called the Omega Files? Yeah, they're actually called the Omega Files. The last two reports are in the next chapter. The last letter is available anywhere from chapter 9. The monoliths are only available in the hidden dungeons of the game, which are the ridiculously annoying uh, A Menace d Sleeps Within. Why didn't I decide to do all these anyway? I'm an idiot. Then the Omega Files are available everywhere in the game except for the very last, um, except for the la except for three of the last four. Those ones are well, basically three out of seven of them are only available in Chapter Thirteen. Yeah, so all the other ones are available everywhere else in the game. I guess I can save- oh, I can't save my game right now. There's a big red button, I'm gonna push it! Meaning, there's someone inside? I was. What kind of question is that? <laughs> of course. That's why you came. Like I believed you would. Pronto. That's why I told myself I couldn't die. Not until I could see you. And hear you tell me I'm not a fake. That I'm the real me. I'm sorry. Don't be. Everything's alright now. I already know where the device is because of bugs, like a glitch, so I could have just activated it the entire time, but I decided not to because I might have crashed my game, and I didn't want to lose all my save, so yeah.
Once I get to a point where I can physically save my game, I'll be no. fine. Do you hear that? You hear what? I've heard this sound before. On the train, just before your weapons failed you. It's nearby. And it may hold the key to restoring your power. Yeah. <coughs> it's here. <coughs> Door's locked. This thing? It's coming from within. Is there no way through? There's a way. So, MTs, they've got those code prints. Just like I do. Do they? Never looked. Yeah. So, as it turns out, I'm one of them. Not exactly something I could tell people growing up in Lucis. Still, you guys are like the only friends I've ever known. I just hope that things can stay the way they were. Whatever. Who cares where you were born? I don't see you turning against us. Not now or ever. Thanks, guys. Still, I can't change where I came from. And I'm gonna skip this SOP session. Cutscene to a big fight. Basically, all you missed was him say, like, literally, there was 10 seconds left of that cutscene of everyone just saying, like, yeah, we get it, you're an enemy, but you're not an enemy, you're not gonna turn against us, so whatever, like, you're fine, bro. That's all it ended up as. New friend? Really? Friends, no choice really. You know, somebody has got to fight to rescue the crystal. Not to mention Now I'm gonna save my game and go back to chapter 15. And I'll just redo that entire stupid fight mission later.
Save. Saved. Okay. Now, return to title. Yes. Sorry, no, I have to go to chapter 14 first. Can't forget that. Can't forget the 14th chapter. Bah. I don't care. Homecoming. I'm literally just going after the only two things here, which are the, um, the two, uh, reports, and then I'm going back to New Game Plus. Sorry, not New Game Plus, uh, Chapter 15. This is a new cutscene. Man, how long was I out? Can't skip that. Umbra! Demons everywhere. What the hell happened? Yes, he lives in a kingdom of magic. We get the joke, but it's actually getting a little bit annoying. Yesterday it was funny, yeah, but like... It's mostly because we get that he lives in a kingdom of magic. Not everyone can Last use it. Standing. when they're really high level. They're so slow and so like small that they seem like they'd be the most ridiculous enemy to fight against. It's the one that you'd insta kill. Like, it's okay. It's just
called a demon wall? Oh, I want to kill this. Oh my lord. it boy something's coming My grandpa served the Amasidia family? Talcott? Now I can skip this. Wow. I can't tell you how good it is to see you again. Yeah, you sure look different, though. You think so? Guess I've grown some these ten years. Ten years? <laughs> the guys must be pinching themselves right now. Where are they anyway? Listalem, more often than not, but they take a lot of trips to Hammerhead. For? Uh, for Miss Cindy. You know, back at the garage. She's a tough one, but uh, when she needs a little extra muscle out on the road, she gives him a call. <sighs> oh, uh, speaking of which, the guys said they're near Hammerhead right now, so we'll be meeting them there. You know, ever since you disappeared, Your Majesty, 
It's been nothing but nighttime, non-stop. Lestalem still has light, thanks to the power plant, so just about everyone's taken refuge there. Only there? Everywhere else has been abandoned. Demons moved in, forcing the people to move out. People still swing by the garage at Hammerhead from time to time, but it usually isn't for repairs. These days it's less of a service station and more of a slayer station, a base for demon hunting. The garage is still open though, one of the few places that is. So, um, Sid, is he still alive and kicking? <laughs> He's kicking all right, just not as hard as before. He hasn't really been himself lately. At least, not since he moved out to Lestalem. Someone suggested he move the garage there, too. But old man Sid wasn't having it. He called it a big, fat, chocobo turd of an idea. Said it just wouldn't be the same anywhere else. That sounds like Sid, all right. Miss Cindy said she didn't mind either way. So the garage will probably stay put for a while. And without any tinkering to do, Ignis's gourmet seafood is about all Sid has left to look forward to. Prowling around, more folk were getting hurt. Or worse. So Iris talked the marshal into taking out the demons themselves. Iris the Demon Slayer, they call her. Gladio and the others, they lend him a hand whenever they can. Prompto spends most of his time hunting around Hammerhead. He tries to impress Miss Cindy, but she's already married to her work. And Ignis? He hunts too. We tried to stop him, but he wouldn't listen. He said if anything, he's more used to the darkness than we are. Never got his vision back. I'm afraid not. But that being said, he gets by pretty well on his own. Gladio and Prompto usually hunt on their own as well. It isn't often you see the three of them together nowadays. They still work as a team every once in a while, but each has his own set of tasks to keep him busy. Is that so? We've arrived, Your Majesty. Everyone will be so happy to see you. Don't worry. I won't be going anywhere. If you have any other questions, please don't hesitate to ask. Geophysical survey of atmospheric conditions. The presence of soot like photophilic particles was confirmed in samples of air taken at varying elevations, with notably higher concentrations at higher altitudes. Photophilic particles have begun to subsume the ozone layer, and the observed reduction of daylight in EOS has can be attributed fairly to the to the light absorbing properties. And the very last one is right over here. Study on nature. Study on the nature of photophilic particles. On examining multiple correlations between the photophilic particles responsible for the blight and the mutant strand of plasmodium associated with the demons, we have discovered a clear causal relationship. Furthermore, given the mass dispersal of photophilic particles upon death, the demon presence is likely accountable for the violent ecology shifts of late. And that should be the very last, uh, that should be the very last report, I think. Yeah, that's the last of them. So that's all of the, that's all of the reports. Three out of the four letters. All of the chronicles I did yesterday. Uh, I didn't do, a, I didn't, I don't think I did that in the stream though, but I might be wrong. Uh, all of the almanac stuff I did in the stream, except for Pityos Runes, is the only one I didn't show. Uh, Cosmogony, I only, I had most of them already, so I skipped most of them. Uh, the Omega Files, I have three out of seven, and the Monoliths, I'm missing five. So, I hope you guys enjoyed the stream. If you did, please like on it, comment, comment what you guys want to see next time, and subscribe if you're new here. I always drive new people around. Anyway, my name is Philip's Gaming. I'll see you guys later. Bye.